What's up you guys? This is your girl Cece and thank you so much for coming to my new YouTube channel Cece Loves. Also thank you so much for clicking play on my very first YouTube video. It's official. I'm um, so excited to be doing this video especially because we're going to be reacting to the new Selena series on Netflix, Latino Gang Gang. I'm so hyped that this is even a thing. But yeah, I'm really excited about it. We're going to be going to my homegirl's house and we're going to try not to judge the actresses and actors too much, but I'm not making any promises. Also, I'm going to be going over a makeup look with you. Not really going over each product and step, but you'll just see me kind of choose uh, what I'm going to be doing and then going from there. I'm going to make another video though um, in regards to what I'm wearing and the look and how to go about this look. So if you want to watch that, stay tuned in the end. Also, as always, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. I will be linking links to the makeup I'm wearing today, different brands, colors, shades, and I might be even posting a recipe on my Tres Leches cake that is going to be featured in this video today, so stay tuned. So here we go. We're going to be watching the first episode of the Salinas series. And what were you saying, Kat? We have to yell because I don't have a microphone. <laughs> well, like I said, I don't care for the actress. Like, mm -hmm. she doesn't look anything like Selena. Mm -hmm. She's not thick like Selena. She's way too skinny. Selena had curves. Selena was a real woman. Exactly. She is not. Like, I don't feel like she's... I don't know. I you don't think feel they like stuffed, she represents. You think well. they stuffed her pants? Probably. We'll see. We'll see. I, I mean, mean, we'll see. Gotta watch the show. Oh, right? <laughs> <laughs> Damn. <laughs> the picture though. How many episodes is it? Forty minutes. It's a bunch. It says part it's, one. Yeah, it said part one. So I didn't know if it if they all came out today. Or they all came out today. Yeah. But they. I guess I'm guessing there's going to be a part two. Probably. We 
not good lip, lip, lip snatching, whatever. She didn't do it good. Episode, wait, what episode did we finish? Three? Yes. So we're on episode four. How do you guys feel about it? I don't want to continue on. <laughs> <laughs> they have ruined Selena for me, and I didn't think that those words would ever come out of my mouth. Yeah. I don't know. I think I'm going to, I think I want to finish it just to see how I feel, but I'm not liking it. I feel the same exact way. It's the acting for me. It's, it's the, the acting. acting for it's me. It's the acting. Because it feels like I'm watching Lifetime, like a Lifetime movie. Wow. It's just, none of it just makes any sense. Well, it not necessarily makes sense, but it's just, like, not piecing together. It, 
doesn't have good mm. flow. Yeah. Exactly. Like, they're trying to go fast, but they're going slow at the same time. Yeah. That like, was the best way to I, put it. I get what they're trying to do because the Selena we all know and love is got popular and the movie didn't show the oh. the beat the like little pieces beforehand. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But it's like, oh my gosh. Yeah. I feel like they could have just gone about it a different way. Yeah. I know. Like, I always pay attention to the makeup and, like, Caddy said, the hair and stuff. But now yeah. it's like, even if you don't pay attention, it sticks out so bad. Like, it's wigs? Really bad. Mm, they're not good. Yeah, but we'll see. We'll finish the part one later. It's a sad story, honestly. Yeah. I think that's the point of what they're trying to do is not make it a sad story. It's probably why it's going so slow, too. But they too. just don't show Selena. They're not. They're, they're not. It's like more of a But if you also really... think about it, she wasn't Selena. She was Selena and the Dinos. Yeah, you're right. This is so that right now. This is Selena y los Dinos. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So but that's probably why. Why they're showing so much of her siblings. And I how much they like made her. I guess, but like, I feel like, I don't know, I feel like this whole series is going to be about like her siblings. Like, I feel like they show more, like, you know, because, like, they were su- they're such background people. Like, yeah. nobody really knows who they are. I mean, her yeah. sister did produce it. Yeah, so, yeah. Yeah. Like, that one episode, well, I guess it just happened where somebody was inspired by Suzette because yeah. she played the drums, which is cool. Like, I'm not even mad at that, that they showed that, but no, it was just, like, it threw all. me off. I was like, oh, I thought this girl was, but we I think thought it was, was the little yeah, girl from the beginning. I think that beginning. was the point, too, was, like, she thought she was there for Selena, but she wasn't. So yeah. she was like, wow, I'm making a difference. I'm too. somebody too in this group. Which I guess. Well, yeah, they are. But this is called Selena. I know. The series. I know. Not the Quintanillas. Because we were all very, yeah. I think we were all very, like, expecting it to be, like, similar to the movie. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I thought it was going to be with that opening. They just chose a different concert to start with, but then it just went like, wait, wait. Well, I kind of was like trying to get out of my mind that it wasn't like the movie. Me too. But the way that she's acting is like giving me such wannabe J Lo vibes. Mm-hmm. And it's like, come on. It's too much. I agree. I think I want to finish it just to see. Yeah. Like, just to say we just saw to it. See just to what say we happens saw it. and what people say about it. But I also want to read about it. Like what people are saying. Yeah. Oh yeah, like the reviews and stuff. Yeah. There's a book on. I think Chris wrote it. Oh Have yes, he that? did write a book. It I was. I read it. a little bit of it, and it was actually very interesting. You know, from his perspective. But maybe that's the reason too, like why they didn't want to get his side and like. I don't know how they didn't get per- his permission. What you were saying earlier, like they that didn't, it gets Chris side. Yeah, sides. because something of like the way that it was was that I guess when she died or something like that mm-hmm. he signed over a lot of rights oh I didn't he didn't know that. realize to his to her family they manipulated him yes, somehow basically. some way and he was that's all that's what distraught. I read somewhere yeah like I gotta when she up. died something happened that he signed he signed something or he did something that basically said her family would be in charge or yeah because he was the dad. husband like mm-hmm. they get the first Right, but her basically. dad is just money hungry, which you can clearly see. It's very obvious, you know, show here too. and in the movie too. Mm-hmm. He was very money hungry, and so I think they, I think, because Chris wanted to keep things a lot like lower, mm-hmm. lower, low key to more himself. like honoring her rather mm-hmm. than exploiting her. Because yes. that's what Selena would have wanted. Yes, he knew and her a best. lot of yeah. people feel that they're just exploiting her at this point. Like she's been dead for like how long, and now we're like, granted, people want it because they want to know about years. her. But like, mm-hmm. do we really need a series about her? I know. Just you bring know? us more makeup that's not by Mac. Yeah. Let's just choose a different brand. <laughs> Because it's just so overrated and it's just too much. It's very theatrical. It's not everyday makeup. I, yeah, I feel like you that. Know what I, I feel mean? like it's stage I've always, makeup. I don't feel like yeah. it's actually like. Which is how makeup. it started out. It's, yeah, you know. It's stage. Yeah. Color pop should make one. Yeah, color pop, really Smashbox, anything. Mm-hmm. I mean, I like Mac, but I, I'm not. It's just over. There's so many other brands out there that don't get credit. But that's a whole nother story because I'm still buying Selena if it comes out. But still. See, but that's what it is. They get you to buy Selena mm-hmm. because it's her name is on it. Oh, you know, so I'm like, yeah, let me snatch it up. Another, like, there's another Chicana, um, what's it called, brand, mm-hmm. uh, Suavecito. What? Yes, I got to get have, on that. Because um, they started out with, like, 
a peanut barbering like line mm -hmm. that's why I know and then they have but it's like they have women's styling products too and they have makeup Ooh. and like their makeup looks bomb oh yeah I gotta and, get on that for um, sure I would like support the that skeletons there's their sugar candies say no more you have me at Swahili Pizza that's what it's called yes okay Awesome. Well, thank you so much for watching us participate in this reaction video. I guess cute. No big deal. All right. Bye. All right, you guys, that's it for today's video. Thank you again so much for watching my very first YouTube video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I hope we weren't too harsh, but we were just speaking our minds. Let me know if you saw the series, if you finished it or not. I think I stopped on episode four. Um, we didn't finish it, but I am going to give it another go because I, I just need to see what's going to happen basically with the acting, <laughs> but I, I have faith it's going to get better. I'm excited to see the rest of it. Shout out to Katiana for opening her house up to me and Megan. That was so much fun hanging out with them tonight. If you want to follow them on social media, I will be linking their Instagram handles and Facebook in the description box below. Also, while you're there, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and follow me on all my platforms at CC Loves on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. I did have a Snapchat, but I won't know if I want to reboost it or not let me know in the comments if you have one um i'll think about reboosting it and let you know um but yes thank you so much and also shout out to mijo gars it's a mexican restaurant that's delicious thank you so much again for watching and i hope you enjoyed i'll see you next time